Hello and welcome back to Mass Effect 3. So last episode we were on the Citadel, um, picking up a whole bunch of side missions, um, and we lost a good friend. So, goodbye Thane. So we've lost Morden, we've lost Thane, like everybody from Mass Effect 2 is just dropping like flies. So I figured now's a good time to get out in the galaxy and uh, start tearing some stuff up. So we've got missions galore. Um, so we're going to see what the galaxy map shows, see what we can do. Um, so now, ex Cerberus scientist, maybe. Speak with the Corians. So there's like... Yeah. So there's like a whole bunch of mission, but they don't show up here as like height or as like a as like glowing things. I wonder what these two. Let's uh, hold on. Let's go back real quick. Let's check our let's check our journal. Uh, recover it from a rune. See, I don't know where that is, and I think I got a couple. Hades Nexus, Hades Nexus. Selene Nebula, Hades Nexus, Selene. This yeah, see, I got stuff everywhere. So that's probably that one, the Asari one. The Corian fleet was that, and then the X Cerberus. So we want Hades Nexus or Selene Nebula. If I can't find those two, then we'll do one of the other more major side missions, these two guys. So Nimbus, okay. Athena Nebula, wasn't that one? Horsehead, Exodus. No, 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 no. Like, am I just like, I just don't have access to it yet? Maybe not. All right, well, let's see. It's ex Cerberus scientist. Um, let's do this one. Cerberus is really pissing me off lately, so let's let's hurt them a little bit. All right, can we? Uh... I found something. Uh huh. Whoa! Reapers did not like that. I hate how slow this moves. Oh my goodness. Alright, what do we pick up? Um, 10,000 credits. I'll take that. That's 50% of the war assets. So what else is here? We gotta run! Let's get out of here. Light jump successful. Whew! Will they come after me here? No, it doesn't look like it. I'm assuming that's probably the only thing here. Yeah, it doesn't look like anything else is here. Alright, let's do this! Yeah, we do definitely have some points to get. So, let's take the new guy. Let's take the girlfriend. So we get a new pistol. The Hornet. Weight is more. Capacity is way down. Fire rate way up. I kind of. The capacity is the only thing, but I don't really matter. Yeah, we always want damage. Thirty percent not using up the thermal clip. Sure, I, I like that. Uh, what about you, Liara? I think I think everybody everybody loves the Hornet. Uh, 
Uh, let's do weight. What about this? Eh, let's keep it. What do you got going on here? Let's start with one. So the Avenger. So he's automatically got this guy. Okay. So this one's weight more, capacity down, fire rate down, damage slightly up, accuracy slightly up. Weight a little bit more, capacity way up, fire rate way up, damage is way down, accuracy way down. Okay. I kind of like this one. I think we can buff this a little bit. Definitely want damage. What's number five? Accuracy, 15%. Capacity way up. Does it really matter his capacity? Yeah, let's do that. Uh, we need some mods on this guy. We don't care about melee damage. Care about that though. Yeah. Give me accuracy and damage all day. That's just what we're going with. So I got eight points. Oh, okay. So we can max out disruptor. More melee damage, I don't really care. More health and more shields, I do care. Yes. I want more health. Caden, you got all sorts of so just auto level up everything. And auto level you. Stasis, great. Love it. What's the word? Do we know how long these scientists have been holed up out here? Our intel is minimal. Sir, I'm picking up chatter from a Cerberus squad engaging the supply depot. Engaging the scientists? And if I'm reading it right, sounds like more troops are on the way. Okay, set us down, then get out of here. I need these scientists alive. <laughs> Random grunt. Hey, Jacob! Oh, don't tell me we're gonna lose Jacob now. You were in Mass Effect 2, run! Look at this! Everybody from Mass Effect 2 is just dying. See why Cerberus abandoned this place. It's Whoa, no, get in cover, All please. Right. Just keep moving. Let's get uh let's get what our do these disruptor. Do to bring this down on their heads? We can't hold them much longer. Wasn't there two guys? Where'd that other guy go? Is he dead? That's bull. Just keep on coming, guys. I'll just keep shooting you. Check for survivors. 
You guys did a lot of work. Caden, you're supposed to be a specter for God's sakes. You did nothing. Did you even fire your gun? Uh, let's check over here. Let's see if there's any hidden goodies. Anything up here? Nope. Nothing up there. Oops. Or right, full up on ammo. Uh, hello? Who's there? Come in, Jacob. This is Bryn. Jacob? How bad? I'll live. I think. This is Commander Shepard of the Alliance. The enemy is clear for now. Open the door. It's okay, Bryn. Jacob. Oh my god. Uh, I'm all right. The others didn't make it. What are you doing here? I'm supposed to be protecting these people from the elusive man and his attack dogs. Are they gone? For now. But they'll be back. Uh, sure you're okay? Yeah. I'll walk it off. Uh, save my life one more time and I'll start owing you. This one's on the house. Hey, yo. Good to see you too. Thanks. And you as well. <laughs> Shepard, this Break, is blank Dr. Wall. Bryn Cole. She's in charge here. Tell me what's going on. Intel says you're Cerberus. We're all ex-Cerberus. Scientists, mostly. Civilians? Call us refugees. If we hadn't run, we'd be dead. Why does the elusive man want to kill you? Our stories are different, but the themes are the same. We were each using information from the Collector Base to work on the different components of a larger tech. After someone completed their component, they disappeared. No bodies, just gone. As we progressed, we started feeling like we were signing each other's death warrants. The elusive man doesn't mess around. If he can't control it, he'll destroy it. The brain trust here has to be a significant loss for him. You had to know they were going to find you. It's a pretty smart bunch. We covered our bases. But the elusive man is one tenacious bastard. Time to evacuate. Agreed. Just need to get the AA guns on the roof back online. Cerberus is jamming them somehow. With those guns down, Cerberus will just blow our escape shuttles out of the sky. Might be the network link. I'll check, and meet you upstairs. Jacob, you should get that wound looked at. I'm good. I mean, I will. Commander, I should see to my people. Join me upstairs when you can. I got a bad feeling you about Jacob. Jacob Another ex-Cerberus? So he worked with me to stop the Collectors. I didn't want to come here with these people. It was his idea. Not... Your partner was brave. He wouldn't want you to crumble like this. He's right. We're getting out of here alive. I promise. Thank you. Who are you? Commander Shepard, I've heard about you. Another Cerberus defector, as it were. Something like that. Dr. Gavin Archer. I imagine we've both crossed the elusive man in our own way. How did you end up here? The research I did for Cerberus hurt a lot of people. I've done things no human should. There I was. With blood on my hands, blood I could never wash away. The elusive man didn't care. He said our goal was greater than any sacrifice it took to attain it. I take it the elusive man didn't just let you resign. <laughs> For a man who loves to lecture about morality's shades of grey, he's very black and white when it comes to obedience. Either you do the job, or you die trying to quit. What kind of work did you do for Cerberus? It was called Project Overlord. An experiment attempting to find non-violent methods for controlling the Geth. That actually doesn't sound like a bad idea. Yes. Well, like most things the elusive man touches, my work became corrupted by decrees. 
Suffice it to say, things didn't end well. How did it go wrong? Serendipity, I'm afraid. The Geth were unresponsive to my attempts to communicate with them, until my younger brother David made a breakthrough. He was an autistic savant, a mathematical genius. In no time, he'd mastered the Geth language and was communicating with them. You're saying he could speak directly with the Geth? It was rudimentary at first, so I decided to take the next step. Tap David straight into their network. It was sensory overload. No mind, even a savant's, could process the barrage information. It drove him insane. Did David volunteer for this? The elusive man kept pushing for results. I was eager to please him. It seemed harmless at first. You mean you forced your brother to do it? Believe me, it's a nightmare I relive every night. He went berserk. His mind became a computer virus that infected all our systems. He killed dozens of lab personnel. We finally had to detonate nuclear weapons over the base to stop the havoc. Sounds uh, wonderful. Awesome. I appreciate your help getting us out of here, Commander. Uh, I don't know if you should get out of here, though. Money? Yes. Money? From Horace to Bryn. Bryn, I don't like this. I've managed to get eyes on some of the research the others were doing, and I'm getting a sense of the big picture here beyond anything we could have imagined, in our worst nightmares kind of imagined. I'm going to start sabotaging my work. That's how bad it is. We need to meet up and talk ASAP. Let me check. We need a two, 250000 for that sweet sniper rifle. So I'm kind of like hesitant to buy new guns and stuff, because I want to save up for that thing. But I really don't like this sniper rifle. I'll pick up a assault rifle magazine. I need you up here. Don't be a jerk. There's only two of those guys. It'll just take me a minute. Med station. And make sure those samples from Project Mia get out on the second shuttle. I've already dropped one box. My hands were shaking so hard. We're going to make it. What's the status of the guns? Still waiting. I have my best people on it. How many scientists are here? 43, plus research assistants. How did you maintain secrecy with that many? When you fear for your life, there's a lot you can do. Bryn, I can't possibly dismantle the genetic amplification components in time. I'm sorry, Dr. Boehner. It's important work, but right now you need to tend to your family. Wait, there are families here? Children? You gotta be kidding. Yeah, you said like, oh, there's only 43 scientists. And assistants. And family. And children. Like, come on. So these refugees brought everyone with them? Yes. We have about 17 kids here. Partners, spouses, parents. I promised these people refuge. A new life free from Cerberus. I just never imagined the elusive man would... That's what evil counts on. That it's hard for good people to imagine. Okay. Everyone left gets out of here alive. This escape will have to be carefully executed. I'd hoped. We tried so hard to make sure it wouldn't come to this. What's the news? Can't tell. Only know I can't fix it from here. I'm going to the roof. Cerberus landed a shuttle there a couple minutes ago. You in? Jacob, you're injured. I'll fix the guns. No way. These are my people. I'm going. Just because you survived one suicide mission doesn't mean you get two. Ah, uh, fine. But I'm gonna talk you through it from here. Cerberus is probably jamming the satellite link. Radio me when you found the controls and I'll give you the override code. Will do. Man, I have a bad feeling about Jacob. I have a feeling that that wound is gonna is gonna turn into something. Doctor Cole, got a moment? Of course. Of course, you have a moment. What's your relationship with Jacob? We went through a lot together. An old colleague of his introduced us. Through Jacob's eyes, I started to recognize what the elusive man had become. 
I guess I was so in love with my work that I refused to see the obvious. Its sponsor had become corrupt. I get that. That's why it's important to have good people around you. I don't know what we would have done without him. What kind of work did you do for Cerberus? Until the elusive man became preoccupied with the Collectors, I worked in physics. It was a researcher's paradise. I had access to cutting-edge tech and all the personnel I needed. The elusive man spares no expense for technical perfection. That technical perfection's almost killed me a few times. It also saved your life. Strange to think about, I would imagine. Maybe. But then, life is full of uncomfortable ironies. Isn't everyone's? How did you get away? I was a loyal senior employee. There's a lot of freedom in that. When our fourth colleague disappeared, we organized and were out the door in days. And until now, Cerberus never suspected you were hiding right under their noses. We honestly thought we had it all figured out. It's humbling. So what's this work of yours that Cerberus wants so badly? It's based on tech gathered from the Collectors. In essence, it involves dissecting Reaper to Collector communications. Dr. Horace Armstrong and I were working on a practical human application. An implant of sorts. Once he'd completed his component and moved on to less valuable work, he disappeared. Thanks, Dr. Cole. I'll let you get on with the packing. Thank you again for everything you're doing for us. You're welcome. Money? Yep. Money? Nope. With Jacob's help, we managed to ascertain that several of our colleagues were, in fact, killed. Contracts terminated is what Cerberus called it. Makeda, Scott, Daniel, Chung Hei. So many others I don't even know about. All of them gone, disappeared without a trace just like that. We should have left sooner. I don't know why we waited so long. I can't remember what seemed so important that we had to stay just one more day. What was I thinking? What were you thinking? These people had no plan beyond hiding. They didn't stand a chance. These civilians what? had no hope of coming out of this alive. Okay. I don't know where that's going to, but... I thought we covered our bases. Shepard, I'm in here. What does he want with us? Why does he... Hey, you okay? How have you been? Give us a minute. I like how we just have all the time in this the world to chit-chat. I didn't think I'd ever see you again. I know the feeling. So how'd you become a gun for hire? Long story. It was an opportunity I couldn't resist for people I came to care about. You seem good. You look good. These are great people. Defending their ideals? I like it. I think I found what I'm meant to do. You still think about what happened to your dad? Haunts me more like... Okay. How long have you known Brit? We met through a mutual friend in the Mumbai cell. Guess I've known her for a year. We had a lot in common. Then she came to me about her missing colleagues. Asked for my protection, my help finding a place to run to. How could I say no? Who is she to you? We're together. And you run this enclave with her? You settling down, Jacob? Yeah, maybe. It's just, um... If these are our final days, I want to spend them protecting these people. Building a life. Whatever's left of it. What's the story, Jacob? Why are you working at a place like this? After we got back, well, things look different when you come back from a suicide mission alive. So I quit Cerberus, I quit everything. And sat by the Mediterranean for a while. That's when I lost track of you. And what did all that fresh air and meditation teach you? That what I choose to fight for better mean something to me. That it comes from the heart. We could sure use you. It's real tempting, Shepard, but I like where I'm at. I'm important to these people. I want a life. I want a family. Sure, I get that. No, Shepard. The Normandy's your real love. Doesn't mean I don't want to say to hell with it sometimes. But you won't. You can't. Anything on Cerberus I should know about? The elusive man became obsessed with indoctrination. I know that. You ever wonder how it all went wrong? I mean... Was I blind? I remember him being an idealist. How come I couldn't see the evil? Don't beat yourself up. 
And if you ever get that crystal ball working, give me a heads up, because I'd love to know how this all plays out. <laughs> right. I should focus on getting these people out of here. You bet. Let's get to it. <laughs> yeah, let's stay a little focus here. But first, we gotta read stuff. Outpost now 48% operational. We've re reorganized some of the storage rooms around the central core, turning them into living units in order to save power. The outer areas are all condemned now, which should provide us with a buffer should Cerberus agents find us. The guns are functional, but I don't like how exposed they are. I'm going to look into findings, finding us some shielding on the black market. Okay, I was hoping for money. Ooh, what are you? Are you money? Yes, you are. You guys got to do better than 1,200 credits, so I'm, I'm just going to say. says we're going to be all right, I trust him. All right, let's go onto the roof. She's just a baby. All right, here we go. Heads up. Die, dirt bag. Shooting blind. Oh, grenade. Let's move up. You are not in cover, good sir. Whoa, hello. Have to find the satellite tower. I like that, whoever did that. Alright, where are we going? I see ammo there. Really? Really? Just no. Okay. It's fine. Can I hit you now? Hey, now I can. Oh. Still coming, huh? I like that little uh, placement up there, though. Let's take the med kit. Jacob, this should be back online now. in our path. Alright, how do I get... Where? Where are you guys hiding from? Oh, jeez. I was about to say, hit him. How do I get up there? It's right here? Can I get up here? Yeah, I can. Shepard, shuttles overhead. I see him. Get in the cover, please. Are you not dead? No, you're not dead. Get that thing out of here. Nothing shooting at us, it is. Commander, trooper on the gun. Gotta get him off that gun. Move up. Keep low and find cover. Oh, I saw him. We have 
have to get up there and activate those AA guns manually. I oh, know I'm working on it. What do you think I'm doing? Shepard's so bossy. Alright. How do we get up there? Aha, ladders. Let's see, is there anything hiding back here? There sure is! There sure is. I cannot get up there. Alright, let's go this way then. Where am I going? Oh, over here. Whoops. Power restored. Gun one reset. Circuit incomplete. The other gun is still down. Let's get over there. Give me goodies. Yes, big time money. At and what? Okay, one of us has to make these repairs. Oh, good lord. All right, Caden, you're on it. Caden, you do the repairs. Yes, sir. Stay focused, Liara. Just you and me. We got a you shuttle coming you. in. Ninja lady coming in. Where are you going, ninja lady? I can see you. How are the repairs coming? Working on Man, they're coming from everywhere. Oh, ninja lady. Ha! You got caught up in the little freaking singularity. Whoops. Any more? Come on, Caden. Let's get the show on the road. All done. Just need to bring the guns back online. Gotcha. I'm on it. Seriously, he was standing right there. He couldn't have done this. Let's get these people out of here. Oh, I could have jumped on this thing. Oh well. Okay, the guns are already picking Cerberus ships out of the sky. Where are we at? On track. First shuttle is already loaded with everyone under 16. Commander, when should we leave? What's our best chance for survival? Jacob, what do you think? Are we ready? Almost. We could go now. But there's no do-overs here. Agreed. We get one shot. And we don't want to leave anything behind that could strengthen the elusive man's cause. Your call. Wait for my go. You can begin the evacuation from the command terminal. Is this got just it. to make sure I got everything? Evacuation level is alpha. It's at the same mess. Yeah, I think this is just if I want to make sure I pick up everything. Um, uh, let's just, let's go ahead and just do it. Where was that at? Over here? Evacuate 
Evacuation is go. Evacuation is go. Stand by for shuttle launch. Have the guns punch a hole in the perimeter, then launch shuttle one. Here, head to the shuttle bay and... Suicide fighter took out one of the guns. Cerberus troops are... Uh-oh. Get those people out of here! Oh, I thought we were done with this mission. Apparently not. Come on, guys. What are you guys doing? Let's go, people. Clear the shuttle bay first so we can bring the door up. Then get out to the landing pad. Will do. Whoa. Jacob, bring up the main door. Got it, Shepard. Will do. Okay, let's get these people out of here. Here we go. Let's get the cover. What's your status? The facility's overrun. Cerberus troops are all over the place. One more shuttle of refugees to go, right? Affirmative. We got this. Just need to hold them a little longer. Oh, Caden. Shield generator. What shield generator? That was the last of the civilians. Shepard, heads up. The place is overrun. We gotta go. Head to you with the shuttle. Oh boy. Understood. Jacob, hang tight. Ooh, that hurt. Still got a lot of armor left. Not anymore, he doesn't. Jake, landing area cleared. This place is crawling. We're bringing the shuttle to you. Roger that. Holy crap, there's a lot of them. Oh no, Jacob, no! Get back in the shuttle, Jacob, no! 
Get back in the shuttle, Jacob. Out by the skin of our teeth again, hey, eh, Shepard? Nice to see you back in action. Yeah, feels good. I was afraid we wouldn't get anyone out alive. But because of you, we got almost everyone. Thank you. Dr. Cole, I have a request. One you can't afford to turn down. I need your help against the Reapers. Without a doubt. I'm at your service. And I'm sure you can count on the others as well. You too, Jacob. I need you. Of course. But I wouldn't mind staying with these folks. Keep them safe. Yeah, I understand. The Alliance needs that crucible. You got it. All right. Report to Admiral Hackett for your assignment. You know, Commander, I've never met anyone like you. Just feel better knowing you're on our side. Thanks. Shepard, when this mess is over, drinks are on me. Be safe out there. I thought for sure Jacob was a, was a goner when he jumped out of that shuttle. I was like, oh, here we go. Hack it here. I'm sending you a large team of scientists. I have the dossier. They're all Cerberus defectors. Keep them safe. Will do, and I'll put them straight to work on the Crucible. Jacob Taylor is with them and is already working to find a place for the families. He'll be a valuable asset as well. Snagging Dr. Cole from the elusive man is a coup. Having her on our side could be a huge win for us. The sooner we can get the Crucible finished, the better I'll feel. I'm with you. Shepard out. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. Ooh, how much money do we have? <gasps> We're in the 200,000s. Not enough, but... Shepard. I was hoping you'd check in again. You okay? Been putting my old academy training to use. Organizing the resistance. You know you've got quite a fan club back here. Any news we hear about the Normandy gives hope to the guys in the trenches. I know what that's like, fighting in the dark. I'm glad we're making a difference. It's more than that. A lot of these people have never held a gun in their life. When they heard that you managed to get the Torians and Krogan to cooperate, that was a shot in the arm, Shepard. Of the one thing we're in short supply around here. Faith. That any of us will live to see another day. How bad is it? It could be worse, but not much. Can you still coordinate any kind of counterattack? We're hitting the Reapers every chance we get. Mostly guerrilla-style hit and runs. But it's not enough. It's time we started focusing our efforts. Where? London. Something big is happening there. Our networks in the UK say the Reapers have arrived in huge numbers. I don't like the sound of that. Any more details? No. And that scares the hell out of me. Well, the Crucible will scare the hell out of the Reapers. We're counting on it. Oh, and Shepard, I meant what I said earlier about Kai Lang. The Reapers may seem like our biggest threat, but take it from me. Lang is a vicious bastard. Don't underestimate him. Noted. Then I'll let you get back to it. We need whatever good news you can send our way. That is enough. Alright, that's going to do it for this ep- Whoop. Whoop. This episode, guys. Check back next time when uh, we'll do maybe that Asari side mission. Um, and see what else trouble we can get into. See you then. Bye.